Hey, what's up, everybody? Adobe Masters here. And today I'm gonna be showing you how to put some video inside of text like so. So this is what we're gonna be generating right here. Let's get started on this very quick effect. First things first, I'm gonna go ahead and import some footage into my sequence. This is gonna be my background layer. It is just this shot of a volcano. I got off of Envato Elements, a great subscription-based service where you can get a near unlimited amount of stock footage for a monthly price. Check out the link in the description below. We're then gonna to go to the type tool right here. And I'm gonna go ahead and type out Iceland once again. We're gonna make sure the essential graphics pane is open up here. If it's not, window essential graphics to open it up. We're then going to go down. I'm gonna make this a little bit larger by scaling it up. I can then click these two center buttons to make it perfectly centered. And now we're ready to begin the effect. This next part, we're gonna grab another piece of footage here. So I have this pieces of floating icebergs here, which is just a, a nice Icelandic iceberg place as well. We're gonna take that, I'm gonna drag it over into my essential graphics. Make sure it's you're in the edit and you're selected so you have that pane right there. We're gonna drag it right up and we're gonna put it right beneath the footage here. So this is great, we can actually add video into the essential graphics now. We're then going to go and click on Iceland, go down to mask with text like so, and we are going to then just click that button and it's gonna work perfectly. If you wanted to do the reverse, you can also do that, which kind of looks pretty cool in here as well with the, the lava, but your choice on that one. Once we have this effect created, it is now a layer in and of itself, so we can actually apply some effects to it. I like to apply something like a drop shadow to the effect itself. We then go down to our drop shadow that we added and we can add a little bit of distance and then soften that up a little bit. Maybe make it a little bit more opaque. And there we go. Now we have created our effect. It looks like it's floating above the background and our video is working. Quick tip, if you want to move the video behind, you can actually click the video here and drag it around if you would like to redo where the video is working. Just make sure you, you don't do you know outside the realm, otherwise you are going to destroy um, the text. But right here is fine, so we have some of that blue. So now you can see that we have a different uh, viewpoint right here. Thanks everyone for joining me. If you have any questions or comments, throw them in the comment section below. Go ahead and the subscribe button to see more videos similar to this one and other Adobe products. Keep your learning going. Subscribe and click that bell. Thanks everyone. Until next time, see ya.